welcome back to my channel. I'm Lorena at Lorena Travel Mundo. I would like to take this time to thank all my subscribers, new and old. Thank you so much for your support. It really means a lot to me. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button and also the bell button so that you can get notified every time I upload a new video. The hubby and I decided to take the weekend and go to Gimpo. Gimpo is about 40 minutes north of Seoul and we had never been here this whole time we've been in Korea. So we really took the opportunity to get to know um, Gimpo and the stuff that's around it, which we were actually very surprised because they have a lot of touristy stuff. We went up for two days and we stayed at a love motel because, you know, everybody that follows me knows that I love all the love motels. <laughs> but yes, we stayed in Gimpo at a love motel and we um, ended up going to a sort of like a river walk uh, that they have in like right across from the um, hotel. It was it was pretty nice, actually. And then the next day we ended up going to um an aquarium which you know we didn't plan it but it seemed pretty cool so and it was so hot that I didn't want to do anything outside <laughs> but we ended up going to the aquarium and we had such a good time so I hope you guys enjoy this vlog and if you're in Korea I hope it gives you ideas of what you can do outside of Seoul and if you're coming to Korea whenever Corona is over then this could be you know another thing for you to do. And we finally made it to the hotel. Well, this is what they call a love motel. There was even a machine, which I'm gonna show you guys in a minute, <laughs> how you can select your room from like, you know, without having to actually come and talk to somebody. But this is the main feature of this room. This is why I booked it, because I will be in here. I don't know why they always provide you with a PC. Like, I guess everybody games in Korea, but the bed is pretty nice, plenty of room, and then look at how big this TV is. It's like a 60 inch. I love that about Love Motels. They give you such a huge TV. And then this entire thing is the bathroom. Look how nice this is. and super clean. Plus they have room service here and it's really centric to a lot of different stuff. So definitely works every penny, which wasn't that much. This is pretty much 80 bucks a night. And that's because I chose the most expensive room because it has the chair and it has the tub. <laughs> this is what I was talking about. You come here. This is the basement part, and you can choose your room, whatever room you like that is available. Okay. And you pay. <laughs> That's pretty fucking cool. And this is the outside of the hotel. I think it's like a pretty like um, business kind of thing. business. Yeah, because it's close to the Gimpo Airport. So, a lot of business, businessmen staying around here. All these offices. And all of this is new. So, it's still up and coming. See, all the new stores in Korea, when they open up, they get all these plants as a good luck, like kind of charm for their stores to do good. Pretty cool. 
and we've made it to the front road where there's a lot more stuff so we enjoy about Korea that we can walk to all of these places if we're hungry we can walk to a restaurant to a CU anything to get what we need we don't have to drive anywhere and just park our car at the hotel and walk and here we have some restaurants we're trying to find a place to eat wouldn't be bad Chinese food but right, let's look around Korean barbecue looks like a bunch of new places are opening up but they're not open yet This is the river walk. Oh, wow, look at all the mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We decided on a chicken and beer place. And no, this is not absolute, it's just water. <laughs> You guys it's so hot out here you can see I'm melting my hair is melted pretty much already too <laughs> but we have some good food um, that chicken place was amazing it was real good so now we're just kind of you know walking it off but you know, enjoying the views. Part of ourselves can feel it almost like I don't know if it's real. Cause when we're doing our thing, we're like wheels that won't stop turning. So take me on a trip, 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 nah, trip, trip, trip. Oh, I flick that switch, kill the lights. So, you guys, this is the best thing about Korea they give you free gym equipment every park so that you can always stay healthy no excuses enjoying the walk Oh yeah, mask at the ready. It's like so nice over here. He's talking about mask at the ready and he almost dropped it in the river.
So it is day two of our little mini vacation and we are in Gimpo. So we were looking around and see what's around here because this little vacation we didn't really plan anything specific so we're just doing it day by day. And we found a, a, uh, an aquarium, it's, like, um, it's called Aqua Planet, it looked pretty cool. I haven't really been to an aquarium in here in Korea yet. Uh, I know there's one in Seoul at uh, the Coex Mall. It's really popular, but since we can't really go to Seoul, we have to find things that are outside that area. So this one is in a place called Ilsun, which is like above uh, Gimpo. Uh, but I'll put all the details, of course, on the description for you guys if you want to check them out. So you guys are going to follow us on day two. We've made it to the aqua planet. I think over here is a theme park. Tourist information. And the aqua planet is this building over here. It's pretty cool. They have a lot of things here for you to do with kids in Korea. Aqua planet in Ilsan. I think I'm saying that right, but do not quote me. <laughs>
바닥이라고 알고 있는 한 가운데에요. 저기 바닥 보시면 파란색으로 바뀌었습니다. 자, 그냥 바닷물이에요. 튀게 되면은. 